We are here at the Congress because we are very interested in being involved in the Hydro Sustainability Assessment Protocol. We've been involved for the last two years and we are supporting its implementation. We would like to continue to be involved in it. The protocol is important because sustainable hydro is the way to go and from the point of view of Transparency International, a very important component of that is to promote transparency, integrity and accountability and to do our best to ensure that there is no corruption associated with the development of hydro projects. I've been involved in, as a member of the Hydro Sustainability Assessment Forum, which began its work in March 2008. So over a two and a half year period, I was part of the group that oversaw the development of the protocol and it involved a lot of very uh, detailed work by all the members of the forum as well as by the coordinator uh, Helen Looker. In this challenging world I believe hydropower has a major role to play but we should be focusing on sustainable hydropower and one of the important aspects of that is that the people who are affected by the project should be seen as partners in the project and we feel that's very important and uh, by focusing on reducing the risk of corruption in all aspects of the project, we are helping with that objective. The involvement of Transparency International in the development of the protocol is something that the chapters of Transparency International can play a role now in its implementation because of the expertise and the uh, local knowledge that the chapters have uh, we can, through the protocol, train them in how they can be involved in its implementation. And we did organize a workshop on the protocol at the International Anti-Corruption Conference in Bangkok last year where four chapters participated. And we would hope that they would continue to be interested as we roll out the implementation of the protocol.